Okay, quick update for the dump load on the wind turbine. So I uh, uh, got it all apart, took the wind turbine out of service today and ran into a little bit of a, well, a couple of snags. One is the one of the resistors I wanted to use is no good. So I've got I'm one resistor down. Uh, we're going to go forward without it, but you can see I don't know what happened to it, but it broke and uh, came apart a little bit. So clearly no good. I ordered a new one. Uh, and I'm also still waiting for uh, the amp meter voltmeter unit that I ordered for it as well. So I don't have that yet either. Uh, but I'm going to put the rest of it here uh, together so I can put everything back in service and uh, get everything mounted permanently here. And uh, you can see I've got the shunt already mounted along with all of the uh, terminal blocks and everything's wired up and ready to go here. Uh, the blue resistors on the left are the uh, emergency uh, over voltage resistors that uh, I can talk about probably in the next video, but those will be uh, those are not hooked up at this point. Uh, in the pre preliminary test here, uh, just to have everything wired up so that the uh, wind turbine can divert through the resistors uh, when necessary, and it's uh, it's working okay. Uh, and I've got the one bad resistor in there just as a placeholder. And uh, when the new one comes in, it should be exactly the same as that one. And I should be able to just unbolt that one and bolt in a new one. Uh, and I still have the solid state relay uh, and uh, the, uh, the mechanical relay over on the board. All right, so first test with the electronics hooked up. And you can see it's working. It's uh, registering duty cycle and temperature. Temperature sensor is uh, just below the resistors. And uh, it uh, may not be positioned exactly right, but it's, uh, it's pretty close to where it's going to end up, probably. Um, and you can see that the duty cycle is, is uh, responding there, going up and down as the uh, turbine is sending more current through the resistors and everything's not wired uh, permanently yet but everything is all the electronics are actually connected um, just uh, haven't quite got it buttoned up all the way Okay, so with everything buttoned up now, all the electronics permanently connected, uh, just checking, make sure everything's still working, and it looks like we're still good, and uh, still reading everything properly. So, gonna leave it this way for now, and when the other parts come in, we'll pick it back up and do the final video. So this was part two.